It's been nearly 13 years since I originally bought Minecraft, and the only reason I remember that is thanks to this terrible quality screenshot from the old Mojang website. But all this time later and I'm still playing it, having sunk thousands of hours into this silly block game that cost me 8 euros or something. And I often get very nostalgic about that era, back when the game was still so new and updates were full of surprises and secrets. And perhaps even more nostalgic than playing the game itself was watching it on YouTube. Let's plays from the likes of David R 64 yt and his X-Cave, Paul Swords Jr playing on a server with his kids, and of course who can forget the Shadow of Israfel series from the Yogg's cast. They all showed different perspectives and playstyles and I remember just being obsessed watching them. And in all that rose tinted gazing, it got me thinking. Though I can't turn back the clock and re-experience all of that, I can at the very least go back to that particular version of Minecraft I was playing back on the 1st of September 2010. And thanks to the wiki, I can see that it would have been alpha version 1.0.17 underscore 4. The game has changed a heck of a lot since then, but I'd like to think, going back, I could still survive and thrive. Let's have a go, shall we? Alright then, here we are, look at that old Minecraft logo up there. Oh, classy, thank you, we are classy Minecraft, how did you know? Right, single player, let's start a new world and hope none of this crashes or acts weird. Wow, wait a minute, <laughs> straight in there with a block in our face. Minecraft Alpha version 1.0.17 underscore 4, there it is folks, we have travelled back. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, wow. I mean, just oh, look at this neon grass. Wow, it is all just so. It's just that sound, that crunch, that blue water. This is how I, uh, you know, this is how most people saw Minecraft. Apart from all those stupid little children that play it nowadays. No, us old timers, <laughs> we saw it like this. Okay, so I'm going to have to remember how this game even works. Because um, I don't really... I don't really know. No, I do. Like, for example, I know there's no hunger. Look at that, there's no hunger down there. There's no shields. There's no nether. There's no nether in this version. The nether came out in, uh, in the Halloween update of 2010. So, yeah, we're just before that. Let's grab some wood. Some things never change. You still have to punch trees and make some tools. Weirdly though, did you see that the saplings were dropped by itself? I didn't even remember it did that. Like saplings are just dropped from the trees. Oh wait, are some of the leaves starting to despawn already? Maybe that's why. That's very loud though. I don't think there's any there are no sliders here, it's just sound on or off. <laughs> Leaves are just going to have to be really loud. And that's that. So the main mission for this video, as I say, is to survive and thrive. I want to see if I can not die. And if I can make a nice little base or something along those lines, some sort of some sort of building to commemorate the fact of me coming back here. Hey, look at that. Coming back here to this version of Minecraft. And just having a good time. Just relaxing. Jumping around with these sheep. I forgot that the <laughs> I forgot that animals used to jump all the time. <laughs> We've got some excited sheep here, everyone. Whee! Oh, okay. Yeah, that that's the main goal. So this could last 10 minutes. This could last hours. I'm hoping it lasts hours because I'd like to think I'm pretty good at staying alive. But all it takes is one mistake and we're toast. Like uh, eating, you know, eating is just like instant health now, isn't it? So that's going to be interesting.
Man, the terrain was just... I mean, I know they've recently, fairly recently, done a sort of uh, caves and cliffs uh, terrain generation update. And it is better now, but you still can't beat some of this stuff. Like, look at this beach we got here. With a, a few cacti. I guess there was no deserts. Uh, yeah, and just look at these mountains. And look at those uh, look at those cows over there. I was going to say sheep again. No, Joe, those are cows. Sheep are the white ones. Cows are the black and white ones. Oh, they're very loud, though. Okay, oh, chickens. Chickens are going to be very useful. I really hope this game doesn't crash. I actually did crash <laughs> when I first started to play. And then after it stopped crashing, it then didn't have any sound. So I had to fix that as well. But fingers crossed. Fingers crossed we're done. By the way, you may be thinking, ooh, look at all this nasty you know, shadows and lighting. I'll have you know, folks, this is on fancy. This is as fancy as it got. It's staying on fancy. Render distance far, view bobbing. Actually, I might turn view bobbing off. Yeah, yeah, I don't actually like view, view bobbing very much. Okay. I bet some of you watching this are like, oh, thank God. Let's have a little peek in a cave. Hello? No, right, we need to... It's going to start turning night soon. Like, it's already midday. Oh, my God, that... Oh, my God, those blocks up there look like my logo. I know it's just three blocks, that's all it takes, but still. Look at that! Out the way, Cloud. That's a sign. That's a sign. That's my banana up there. Oh, okay. This is this is it. This is where our base is. We have to go below the floating banana. This is quite nice, anyway. Apart from the the volume of the animals and splashing water. Yes, we have to go here. Now, I see some coal over there. Any coal down? No. Oh, is that going to be the closest coal? I think it is. Okay, that's fine. How do I open? I went to press E. That's not how you open your inventory. What is it? I. Can I change it to E? I can, yeah, E just, it's E, come on now. Let's not go too crazy. E. Right, let's make... <laughs> Did you see what I tried to do there? I tried to do the whole, like, click and drag. Nope. Let's make a workbench, working bench, crafting table, whatever you want to call them. Make some sticks. Let's make... Oh, that's not too good. Let's make a, a shovel and a pick. That's not going to be... Uh, actually, that might be enough blocks if I go up here. <gasps> oh, the music! Oh, the music, yes! I'm keeping that playing. Usually I turn off music immediately. But I think I just press shift as well. There's no shift. I could fall so easily. Oh, that's very loud though. Too bad. So sad. That's the way it was. make some torches because it is going to be night very soon and actually we probably need some more blocks um, okay let's take this 
Can I see myself? Oh, I can. Oh, with Steve. Okay. I don't know if that would actually work, it, like loading my skin. I don't know how that would work. It probably... It probably could if I... I don't know. Do I care enough to try and make that work? No, we're going to be Steve. It makes sense to be Steve. Did I... Did I even have the muck -like skin? I can't even... I can't remember when I got it. Like the Consuela Family Guy skin. I don't know. Right, we're going to have our... Look at this. There's even like a little doorway pre-made here. Now, this will be a little temporary shelter. We have bigger plans for this. We're not we're not going to stick in a little stay in a little hole in the side of the wall for the whole time. But I'm very excited to go down and start caving. Caving is where I think the game oh, there goes our pick. Uh yeah, like just caving is just going to be a lot more difficult, a lot more deadly. Let's make a stone pick and actually let's make a sword. Um, that'll do for now. I need to get some food. In fact, it's okay. Oh, there was coal there as well. It's okay. There's no crit. What am I doing? <laughs> what am I jumping for? Wait. They're not... Do sheep drop food? I don't think they do. Oh no, how am I going to get food? Chicken. Chicken? Uh oh. Uh. Oh, that was, that, that sound then, that was me, those footsteps, but I thought someone was digging. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, it's night time. I guess we don't actually need food until we do. We're not going to start like, you know, losing hunger, starving. It's only when we take damage we'll need to use it, so as long as I'm wise, we'll be okay. All right, time to time to retreat, time to retreat. I'm not messing around with these guys right now. No, 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 no. In we go. Ah, oh. okay. Well, there we are. That was our first morning. Well, first day. The whole day. We didn't actually do too well, did we? Well, we got a few bits. Hmm. Well, I, I guess I'll just get some more cobble whilst I wait, because I, I don't think I'm well equipped enough to go down and start caving it. I think we need some food. We need some armor. I don't even know what, like, where is iron going to be? Is iron going to be on a particular level? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to have a little peek outside. See if I can see any baddies. Not at the moment. Again, I just tried to shift then to see more of the sky. That's not going to work, Joe. That's not going to work. Okay. So, what am I going to do then? Wait 10 minutes? <laughs> I guess that's really the only thing I can do. Um... Wait 10 minutes and maybe reminisce a little bit. This is reminding me. So I, th I I actually think, I'm trying to remember like the actual first Minecraft video I watched. And I'm pretty sure, as I mentioned in the intro, I think it was David RYT64, better known as X, X's Adventures in Minecraft. I think his video where he first started playing Minecraft was the first one I watched. Um, 
which is why I'm getting big sort of like X cave first night vibes here. And you know what? It's one of those things where I say this like, oh, back, you know, all those years ago, though, that YouTuber, he's still going. In fact, he's making a Minecraft series right now. So, you know, not everything vanishes. Um, obviously, it's a very different vibe. But yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, this might be a bit foolish because it could be above me. It's not on peaceful, is it? Let me just make sure I haven't put it on peaceful. No, it's on normal. Okay. God, it's so dark. There's, there's no brightness level, is there? No, of course there's not. <laughs> of course there's not. I remember like some people used to just up the brightness in, in post. Because YouTube obviously makes things slightly darker. So it's the only way to be able to see things sometimes. I don't see any enemies though. I'm being very risky here. I could so quickly die. I can't remember how closely they can spawn to you though. So they might not actually be able to spawn that close to me. God, it's so dark. Okay, I just want to see one, just so I know that they're actually spawning. <laughs> and that this is actually working properly. Because now I'm getting a bit worried that there's just no enemies anywhere. Oh. Well, that was ominous. Oh, yeah, there they are. <laughs> it's not Shaun of the Dead then when they're looking at the, <laughs> the letterbox. Oh, yep, yeah, there they are. Okay, no, there are monsters. There are monsters. It's all good. This is working. I'm going to retreat now. I'm going to retreat to the relative safety of my M cave, let's call it. If he had X cave, I'm going to have the M cave. Very good. Okay. We'll do that for now. We might still get hit by skeletons, but I feel confident that won't happen. All right, so we can make a furnace. Oh, oh, look at that. The furnace has got a smooth stone top. And also faces a weird direction when you place it. That's strange. What, do I have to do it like this? Nope, it always wants to point that way. Okay. I'm not going to question that. What was that other thing that came up? Uh, no, or was it two on top of each other? What was it? I saw something... Oh, there you go. Oh, it's slabs, of course. Smooth stone slabs. Right. Uh, let's, um... Bed? Is is there a bed in this version? I don't think there is. I This is going to really test my knowledge. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a slab. <laughs> it just looks weird. Looks too thin. No, there's no bed. There's no bed. What are these? Oh, they're... that's not a slab, that's a pressure plate. I just wasted three whole planks for... Oh man, I remember seeing the first video. Was... Oh, and I've compl... Do you know what? I've got so many memories just rushing through my head. Um, there was also someone else. There was another uh, YouTuber that I used to watch very early days of Minecraft. Um, and I've completely forgot his name. He... He had a song as an intro. How did it go? How did it go? I'm going to have to really think now. Hang on. Do, 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 diddle, do, 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 diddle, do. That, it went like that. It went like that. Someone must know what I'm talking about right now and, and, and shouting at the video. I'm going to have to Google it whilst it's nighttime in the game. Oh, it's daytime and I found it. CoStar. CoStar. That was another one that I used to watch. And I, I vividly remember his series, he was do he was making a train station and I was just, okay, careful now. I was, I've used the word obsessed so many times, but I was obsessed with the idea of making a train station. 
because you used to be able to have the uh, like the minecart boosters. I wonder if I'll be able to make one now. Well, once I get some iron, maybe. Anyway, um, yeah, co-star. Co's, what? Co's quest. Co's quest. That's what it was called. Co's quest. Yeah. Um, what was I talking about before that though? Oh, I can't remember. Let's just get on with this. Let's get on with this. Um, I'm gonna look in this cave now. Now I've got some torches. Oh. <laughs> All right then. Well, let's not let's not bother with that. How am I going? Where did those cows go? Well, oh, animals. Animals. It doesn't matter if you kill them, right? Animals just um. Don't animals spawn in light in this version? Going this far back. I think they do. I think you can just put a torch down and there'll just suddenly be loads of them at night. Piggies. Okay, you surely have to drop food. Surely. I remember. I remember the pork chops. Please. Maybe you were just a, a greedy piggy. Hang on. Come on. No. Yes. Okay, great. Now, I also think I'm right in thinking if they actually drop some more of the damn things, these don't stack. No, they don't stack. They don't stack. You have to line up your food ready to... ready to spam. When you're in trouble. Oh yes, look at all this. But that does mean, I remember like, when you used to go caving, you could only take a set amount of health with you. Like you didn't want to fill your inventory with pork chop, did you? So, okay. What's the plan? Oh, the plan is to find iron. And I guess to find iron, we need to find a good cave. Now I, don't recall caves being that difficult to find this far back. In fact, I used to quite like how there would just be a, you know, a few blocks open and then it would enter into this gigantic uh, uh, spaghetti of caves. Actually, that's the wrong, wrong word there because I think aren't they actually called spaghetti now? Like the, the generation system. Oh wow, this is really giving me X's Adventures in Minecraft vibes. Like the, I remember he had like two two mountains. There was like a little gap between them, and like the X cave was around here. <gasps> Maybe this is the same seed. No. <laughs> All right, let's go grab some more coal. Okay, so one thing I need to bear in mind. Oh, there's more coal is not to get lost. That's why I built under the banana. Look at this, when I'm off gallivanting around the world, I look over, there it is, the beacon. The banana beacon in the sky. Looking up to the banana in the sky. That's where I wanna go when I die. But I don't wanna die. So instead I'm gonna kill these cows. That way I can get some armor. Because I feel like it's going to be a long time before I get enough iron. Oh, a little forest coming up here, that's nice. Oh, hello. What do we have down here then? Hello, hello, hello. All right, careful, Joe, because there could be a skeleton right down here and then that's it. I don't hear anything. I don't hear any jingle jangle. No, we're good. Darn. 
All right, well, I'll grab the coal at least. I remember what I was going to start talking about before I interrupted myself of CoStar. Uh, Redstone, I remember watching, yeah, the first video on Redstone and just being completely bamboozled by it. Because uh, I think it was, yeah, it was X and it was just showing off Redstone opening a door. And it was mind-blowing. Uh, just think how far I've come since then, the Minecraft Redstone yeeny eye that I am today. Back then, having his mind blown. It's quite remarkable when you think about it, isn't it? Right, I'm going to head in this direction now. I don't want to go too far from home, from the banana beacon, so yeah, we'll head this way for a little bit. And actually, let's look at the sun. Oof. Oof. Uh, I think we might just have to go back home. I think we might. Actually, before we do though, let's grab some gravel. Because I'm assuming that the, the gravel does actually drop thin. It does. This lovely, not at all headache inducing, static like texture of gravel. Okay, we're back home. Let's make an actual little doorway. There we go. And actually, speaking of doors, let's make a door. It's taking us this long. There we are. And we can hear that nice door sound as well already. Oh. Oh. That's a good, that's a good sound. That little, that little rattle in it. Mm. Okay, right. As you can see, right on cue, the sun is starting to set, so. Instead of trying to find a cave and waste 10 minutes just in here, I'm gonna dig down. I'm gonna dig down and hope that I come across something. I really don't know if this is gonna work and like, is this how you can find caves in this version? I mean, I, I assume so, that they're under there somewhere. It's just, am I gonna get lucky? We'll see. And I guess whilst I dig, what else can I reminisce about whilst we're on this reminiscing train of thought? I suppose the other series that I mentioned in the intro, um, oh, where's my second one? Was Paul Sauce Jr., who I didn't watch a ton of his stuff, but there was a few series that I did watch, and one of them was when he was playing on a server with his children. And I, I, again, I have one vivid memory of a video where there's like a zombie attack, and he's showing off like how his kids made this fort in their world. And also just the fact that he was playing with other people was also just kind of like, wow, that's great. Um, I want to do that. And, you know, it took me a few years, but I did eventually. Uh, so yeah, Paul Sauce Jr. And he had the Survive and Thrive series that I referenced as well. So, um, And then the other person that I remember, well, I say person, group, this is going to be the most obvious out of all of them, uh, the Oxcast. The Oxcast and... Well, what came to be the Shadow of Israfel series, it didn't start off, it just started off as them playing Minecraft and then it you know, had that story start to attach to it and these other characters and you didn't know whether these characters were. I remember people thinking, oh, are these NPCs? Is this like a thing in the game that they've found? Because they're so realistic and it's like, so stupid thinking back. Like, no, they're quite clearly other people <laughs> just role playing as, uh, um, God, what were some of the names of them? There was like this, uh, Damn, what are they called? First they went to the little town. There was Granny. Who was the Granny that died? <laughs> they had a funeral for her. Uh, all the names are escaping me now, but... Lysander? Sky, Cap, Sky Captain? Something like that? They went to this really cool... I remember thinking it was a... Like, I remember just being blown away by some of the builds in that. Like, they, they built this entire city... Um, and towns and villages and it just got more and more crazy as it went along and that that was actually like <laughs> it sounds so stupid but that was proper you cannot wait until the next episode came out like that was just so thrilling 
That was back when YouTube was just like an absolute must watch. Better than any film or TV. I was like, what is going to happen in the next part of Shadow of Israel? Oh, good times. I don't really watch Shogscast anymore. I mean, they don't really do a lot of... They kind of stopped doing Minecraft. They've probably not done Minecraft for as long as they have done Minecraft now. Um, they do a lot of, like, TTT and stuff, don't they? But, yeah, I don't really watch Shogscast anymore. That was that was kind of it. And all their adventure maps that uh, Simon and Lewis used to play together. Oh, well, this is just not... Oh, is that iron? Oh, yes. Okay, great. Just as I was about to say that. That it's not working. Voila. We get a little bit, not a lot, of iron. Just give me a cave, please. Oh, and that's my... Oh, don't stay up there. Come back. Oh, and that's my pickaxe gone as well. All right, I'm going to head up and it's not going to be daytime yet, but restock. Oh, there's some more music. Oh, no, that music sounds more normal. Maybe it was just that one track that sounded kind of strange. Oh. And as the music plays, I was going to say, I'm very conscious this video is just going to be a big lot of member berries. You know, <laughs> that's kind of what this is like. Oh, do you remember that? Oh, do you remember this? But hey, I think it's nice to do that every once in a while. Not all the time, but just oh, go back every now and then. Okay, as the music is still playing, I did hear some jingle jangles out there. There's a skeleton out here somewhere. Not that I can see where they are. Oh, I don't like this actually. Oh, this is, mm, you know what? Let's build a little cover so they can't drop down on us immediately. Well, actually that probably makes it so they can even more. Uh, skeleton? No. No, back in, back in. Oh yeah, I hear them again. Wait, they're this way. Is there, an, is there a cave right here? Surely not, we're, we're too high up. <gasps> oh, maybe there is though, that's like a cave sound. Oh, I don't, oh that, that's just foolish, I'm not gonna do that. All right, back down. Oh, look at that. I come all the way back down here. There's the bedrock or the adminium or the whatever you used to call it. <laughs> oh, okay, fine. I'm, I'm not gonna, I don't, I don't wanna find a cave that way anyway. I wanna find a cave au naturel outside with a nice big hole going down into it. So screw that plan. We're heading back up. Hopefully by then it's gonna start to be daybreak and we can go explore some more. Oh, it is. It is. Great. Okay. Take the, uh, take the iron. Take the iron and maybe make some... <sighs> Do I make boots or no? Boots are kind of rubbish. But they're better than nothing. No, I'm just going to keep it. I'm going to keep it like that. Um, oops. I'm going to make... I'm going to make an axe so we can get some more wood as well whilst we're out. And I've just thought, since I've got so much junk now, clogging up my inventory, let's bake a chest. Let's put some of this away. That can go away, that can go away, that can go... Actually, let's take some of that. Don't need this much cobble. Keep that. I should have oh, I should have smelted up some of this food as well. Let's smelt up some food before we go. 
Let's go, go, go. No creepers. No creepers. Great. So, plan is chop trees. A chop you're good. These radioactive green trees. And we're going to go explore in this direction. And I want to find a cave. I want to find a cave and I want to kill some gosh darn monsters. Is that too much to ask for? Oh, is that is that some surface iron I see in the distance? I think it might be. I did not know that that could be a thing, but hey, I guess it is very random, the generation. Let me grab this. I've traveled a fair way, not a huge way, but you know, a fair distance, still nothing. No sign of any cave, lots of animals though, which is good. I mean, that's a cave, but not the cave I'm after. You're not the cave that I want. Oh, okay, no, all right. I was gonna say, I wondered if zombies still drop feathers, but I guess in this version, they'd fix that. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, is that a dungeon? That sure does sound like a dungeon. That is so loud. Oh, that is a dungeon, look at that. Oh, amazing. <gasps> no, no. No. <laughs> oh, well, there you go. Can I survive and thrive in the Minecraft version when I first started playing? The answer is no, I cannot.